Celebrities don't mess around when it comes to their beach bots. And age doesn't have to impede a star's ability to rock a bikini with class and sass. Mature women like Sharon Stone, Susan Lucci, Goldie Hawn, and Christy Brinkley are teaching the world that beauty is something that can age like fine wine. Join Facts First as we take a look at a few older Hollywood women who are still showing off their smoking hot bods in bikinis. Sharon Stone Primarily known for playing femme fatales and women of mystery on TV and in films, Stone became one of the most prominent sex symbols of the 90s for her steamy role in the erotic thriller Basic Instinct. That performance won her a Golden Globe nod for Best Actress in a Motion Picture Drama. Some of her other notable credits include roles in films such as Stardust Memories, Cold Steel, Total Recall, and more recently Fading Gigolo and The Laundromat. On TV, she's had leading and supporting roles in shows like War and Remembrance, If These Walls Could Talk Too, and the series Ratchet. Born March 10, 1958, Stone will be celebrating her 64th birthday this year, and she's still looking as beautiful as she did 20 and 30 years ago. Take this picture, for example, of Stone wearing a yellow two-piece bathing suit. Not only does she still have a rockin' bod, but she also isn't afraid to step in front of the camera makeup free. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to Factsverse if you haven't already. And stay tuned to see several more mature Hollywood women not afraid to be pictured in their swimsuits. Susan Lucci This All My Children star posted a picture on her Instagram in January of herself spending a day at the beach enjoying the ocean breeze. Lucci, who turned 75 a few weeks before posting this stunning picture, looked drop-dead gorgeous in her white one-piece and indigo sarong. Wondering what her secret is? Well, Susan attributes her good looks and fit bod to Pilates. She told Women's Health earlier this year she takes Pilates sessions six times a week. She went on to explain she tries to take at least one day off a week, but even on her off day, she still does something because her body craves it. While she's best known for portraying Erica Kane on the ABC soap All My Children, the Emmy Award-winning star has also made appearances on shows like Hot in Cleveland, Dallas, and Army Wives. More recently, Lucci starred as Genevieve Delator in the Lifetime series Devious Maids, which ran from 2013 to 2016. Brooke Shields For someone who spent most of their career modeling and acting, it's not surprising she'd be still able to turn heads on social media. The 56-year-old's recent snapshot of herself posing in a yellow one-piece swimsuit had the world collectively picking up their jaws. The photo in question, which was captured by a pro photographer, fellow model, and close friend Helena Christensen, shows Shields leaning against a wall at the beach. Her wavy locks, come-hither gaze, and signature eyebrows leave the viewer feeling downright breathless. It's incredible to think the person in this pic is really in their mid-50s. Shields got her start modeling as a child and managed to garner critical acclaim by the time she was 12, thanks to her leading role in the film Pretty Baby. Throughout her teenage years, she continued acting and starred in several films including The Blue Lagoon and Endless Love. After taking a break from modeling and acting in 1983 to study at Princeton University, she returned to acting in the 90s. She starred in the NBC sitcom Suddenly Susan and in NBC's Lipstick Jungle. For her two roles in those shows, she earned two Golden Globe nods. Since 2014, Shields has provided the voice for Beverly Goodman's character in the animated Adult Swim series, Mr. Pickles. Helen Mirren Born July 26, 1946, this actress has gained much acclaim for her talent in front of the camera. After performing in a production of Antony and Cleopatra, in which she played the female lead in 1965 with the National Youth Theatre in Great Britain, she was invited to join the prestigious Royal Shakespeare Company. In 1975, she made her West End debut. Since then, Helen has had resounding success in film and TV. For her recent portrayal of Queen Elizabeth II in The Queen, she won both an Academy Award and a British Academy Film Award. For her role as Jane Tennyson in the British procedural crime drama Prime Suspect, she won an additional three British Academy Television Awards. Mirren has further given powerful performances in offerings such as The Madness of King George, Gosford Park, and The Last Station. Some of her other notable film roles include The Long Good Friday, The Cook, The Thief, The Wife, and Her Lover, and The Leisure Seeker. In 2008, Mirren stunned the world when a photo of her was published wearing a pink bikini at the beach. The photo was taken by her husband, Taylor Hackford. 
The now 76-year-old actress has since revealed that after noticing the paparazzi off in the distance, she sucked in her stomach and her cheeks to look good for the impromptu shot. Jane Seymour We're thinking 2022 will be a pretty big year for actress and former Bond girl Jane Seymour. In an Instagram post in late January, Seymour, who's now 70, posed in a pink one-piece swimsuit while enjoying herself on what appeared to be a yacht. The photo was appropriately captioned, Seize the Day. She followed that post up with another pic wearing the same swimsuit while asking her fans what the best thing was that happened to them this year so far. Seymour made her screen debut as an extra in the 1969 musical Oh, What a Lovely War. She then appeared in the TV series The Onadin Line from 1972 to 73. After that, she was given the role of the psychic Bond girl Solitaire in the 007 film Live and Let Die, which hit theaters in the summer of 1973. Seymour went on to receive critical acclaim for her role in Captain and the Kings. In 1982, she won her first Golden Globe for her performance in the miniseries East of Eden. She followed that up with a Golden Globe-nominated performance in the 1988 TV film The Woman He Loved. In 1993, she was cast in one of her most notable roles, portraying Dr. Michaela Quinn in Dr. Quinn Medicine Woman. It earned her a further two Emmy nods and four Golden Globe nominations. More recently, she has appeared in films such as Little Italy and Friendsgiving. Goldie Hawn Born November 21, 1945, in Washington, D.C., Hahn displayed a love for acting and dance at an early age. In 1968, she made her film debut in The One and Only Genuine Original Family Band. The following year, she starred opposite Walter Matthau and Ingrid Bergman in Cactus Flower. The role ended up earning her an Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress. From there, her career skyrocketed. Some of her biggest roles in the 70s included parts in films like There's a Girl in My Soup, Shampoo, and Foul Play. In the 80s, she appeared in Best Friends, Wildcats, and Overboard. Her career slowed a bit in the 90s, though she did make notable appearances in films like House Sitter and Everyone Says I Love You. In 2001, she starred in Town and Country and followed that up with a role in 2002's The Banger Sisters alongside Susan Sarandon. The 76-year-old may not be doing a lot of acting these days, but she still loves showing her fans a bit of love on social media by showcasing her ever-bubbly personality and hobbies. Check out this photo of Han from one of her pre-pandemic vacations to Greece. It's clear she still has it going on. Christy Brinkley Last but not least, we have this pic of 67-year-old Christy Brinkley, who still looks drop-dead gorgeous in a black bikini. While she might not be at the beach in this shot, she looks stunning as she snaps a selfie while applying lip gloss standing in front of a mirror. Brinkley first gained worldwide fame with her appearance in Sports Illustrated's swimsuit issue. She went on to appear on the cover of the magazine an unprecedented three consecutive times, beginning in 1979. For the next quarter decade, Brinkley was then the face of cosmetics brand CoverGirl and featured on the cover of more than 500 magazines. She later worked as a TV personality, illustrator, writer, designer, humanitarian, and actress. These days, while she still makes the occasional TV appearance, she enjoys spending her free time soaking up the sun on the beach. And to send you on your way, we'll show you this one last photo of 59-year-old actress Demi Moore showing off her beach body on her recent Greek vacation. Now it's time to hear from you. Which over-50 Hollywood woman do you think looks the best in a bikini these days? Let us know in the comments section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Facts First if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.